I have loaded up some of my favorite pragmatic games here. We're going to be doing bonus buys on all of them. I'll run it back twice if I really am enjoying the slot, but I have a balance of $10,000 here. I picked out like eight games that I love to play that I really don't feature on the channel too much. And the first one that I wanted to show is Wisdom of Athena. I've actually had some really good hits on this slot. It's kind of like a progressive version of Gates of Olympus. Um, well, Gates of Olympus is a progressive slot, but it's a little bit of a different type of progressive. Basically, you need as many tumbles as possible and then I'll unlock more of the board. This is a $2,400 buy and I'm gonna be honest, it's not, wait, what? Okay, I, I figured out what the problem was. I had way too many tabs open. A story as old as time for anyone that knows me offline. I always have so many fucking tabs open on my computer, but I had all the games open in tabs because I was gonna swap to them one after one. So I had to screenshot them and we're gonna have to search them after everyone. What a horrible way to start off the video though. This was just a god awful bonus buy. Greens are gonna hit here though. This is not a bad tumble. It's still a terrible bonus buy. Like, look at this. Paid 2,400 and it paid 320 back. Let's jump to the next one. Fuck this game. This next game I'm a little bit scared of. Juicy Fruits, notoriously, if I were to, if I were to run like a lifelong profit and loss on what this game has done to me, my God, the statistics would be just, ugh. Oh, four scatter. I didn't mean to skip that. The statistics would be disgusting to look at. I have made probably 10 videos dedicated to this slot. I've literally lost every single one of them. Every single one, I've lost all my money on it. I never get good hits on this game. So, you know, maybe today is the day, but bro, we get a four scatter and then, we, okay, that's plus one. We get two dead spins and then a plus one. You know, I want to be optimistic here, but we're getting plus one. You can get up to a plus three and a plus one does, you know? Plus three? Plus two is not bad. This this should be decent. We should be getting a decent amount of money back here. Could be jinxing it, but theoretically it should be all right. This is gonna be a good hit. There we go, sevens and Kiwis. Sensational, 2.6, that's profit, baby. Stay there. No, why are you going to the back? We need two scatters here. Go left, Oh, that's a good spot. Sevens, again, how much is it? Look at that, 4.6K, I'm not running this back though. I am not running this back. I'm not falling into this trap. We're gonna go Sky Bounty next. Sky Bounty is kind of like Juicy Fruits, uh, just better in my opinion. I, I really like it. I had a really, really good hit when this slot first came out. I've had a couple of good videos on it too. I've gotten max win setups on this and unfortunately didn't get the max win. And I also at one point had a dream that I got a max win on this game. Unfortunately, it wasn't true. I would love to get a max win on this game. Nah, it's only a three scatter. I thought that was a third scatter right there or a second scatter. So I was like, did we just get a four scatter again? We did not. So the reason I like this one better is it seems to re-trigger way more often. Like it seems to be way more, way more fair with the re-triggers. Whereas Juicy Fruits doesn't really do it. Of course, I'm sitting here saying this and we're about to not get a fucking re-trigger, bro. We're actually about to not get a re-trigger. Give me two bonus symbols. There's one. Yeah, come on now. You got this, buddy. Bonus. Okay, we did get the retrigger. This is not looking good, though. This is not looking good at all. Plus two spins. Oh, dear God. And I like that you can get a multi on the wild. All right, we need two bonus symbols on this next one. One, two. Yes. Yes, this is a decent hit, too, because we have a wild here. Ah, uh, it's... We got three. Oh, my God. Plus two, so we need two more bonuses to get to the next one. That should be a pretty decent hit. 914. Wilds in, let's go. Come on, give us a re-trigger. Give us a re-trigger here. Wilds, oh, if we would've gotten multiple wilds, that would've been massive. That's a, that's a really good hit though. 2.7. Hey, we're gonna go straight to the next. I, I wanna double it up on both of these. Both of them did really well. Both Juicy Fruits and Sky Bunny did really well. We're going to the next one. I'm not falling into that trap. I'm doing something fucking big for anyone that supports your boy, okay? I am giving away $5,000 in the form of a weekly wager race for anyone that plays under code FencerGG on GamDom. Not only do you get activated for the $5,000 by using my code, players will also get a daily surprise as well as instant daily, weekly, and monthly rake back on all of their bets. And I'm not done there. Make sure you guys go in the description and join my Discord. The link is always in there because you can 
stay up to date with all the leaderboard statistics but additionally i'm going to be giving away free spins in there tips all kinds of bonuses you name it i'm going to be doing it to give back to you guys so to get activated for all this make sure you go over to the rewards tab once you register on gamdom click activate now and enter code fencer gg i forgot on top of all that you also get 15 percent right back for the first seven days by activating thank you guys so much for watching and enjoy the rest of the video so this one is really ass the game does suck it hits different for some reason i think it's because it reminds me of the og buffalo slots that are in the irl casinos and i'm just i, I love them dude i love buffalo i love them i love that and the the holden spin ones are a lot of fun and all the ones that are like mighty cash and shit oh my god man love them love them love them love them but sometimes this this slot well first of all you can get a 93,000 x which that's not even a fake max win guys you can actually get the 93,000 x on this i think like I, i'm 90 percent sure there's someone on stake that's done it uh don't know about gamdom but i feel like i did see someone on stake hit it and then it's oh look at that it's really easy to re-trigger on this too this slot has this script where a lot of times you will get like 50 re-triggers like there's another one there's plus four and the my record my record for a bonus on this game okay was i think 96 spins it, it was some it was in the 90s it was like 94 96 whatever whatever multiple it would be with this retrigger format that's what i was at and i shit you not it only paid like 150x on, on like 96 free spins it was heartbreaking heartbreaking but this slot can have some crazy hits i personally have seen some insane ones ticket time if you guys know him he's had a really big hit i think a couple big hits on this one um there's this guy that i've known since i first started streaming fixer he's had so many good hits on this slot hit like 200k on it i don't know man I i've always wanted to be in that club of getting a great hit on it i mean buffalo king megaways the the sister game of this stan literally had a max win stan gg if you guys watch him you guys don't know he's literally my cousin I, I I mentioned it in videos from time to time. We, you know, maybe we'll make videos one day together. Um, but yeah, he's he's literally my cousin. It's always funny to me that people don't know that. Like, there's people that watch him that watch me and see the GGs. And I guess they just think like we're biting off of each other. But no, we're we're literally cousins. <laughs> so so yeah, that's why that's why we both do this. But he had a max win on Buffalo King Mega Ways. So maybe my first max win is going to be Buffalo King, the OG, the ninety three thousand X dude. How much would a 93,000 X pay on this bet? Would that be like $3 million? Can I get $3 million here, please? This is not looking good. We need a retrigger. I have $368 back. Oh no, last spin here. I need a retrigger. It's over. It's over, man. $2,400 buy paying 368. Yikes. Yikes, yikes, yikes. Next one. I'm not sure about this one, but I was like, dude, fuck it. Let's go play it fruit party too you know what no, no 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 i'm playing the better one wild beach party i've had so many good hits on this one i really haven't played it that much i know it's gonna sound like cap you know because these horny dudes out here as soon as they see the anime girl it's just over dude it's over they're just horned up immediately but i've had so many 1000 x's on this slot i don't think i've had any on gamdom oh i've literally never played this slot on gamdom that's insane uh, but I've had like three different 1000 X's on this slot and I really haven't played it that much like I haven't played it that much at all It's the same exact concept as fruit party 2 where every spin look at that. Give me give me stacked multis No, we deleted them every single spin There's a chance to drop a multi and then every tumble can multiply the multi so it goes 3x 9x 27x and then 81x and whatever's above that um, I, can't, I can't even remember like 243x I think and you can get the multis working together and it hits fucking huge you can get like three four multis working together at the same time and you just gotta hope they don't disappear more often than not they do disappear but in a situation where they don't you just get so much money man so much money give me a multi nice that hits give me another one 27x on that nice stack it maybe no it deleted it we would have had an 81x look at that we already got half our money back Ooh, this could be good Give me one there and one there. The problem is, I think I think the way it works on this is if you have two tumbles hitting together, it usually doesn't drop two multis, and it'll only give you one, which kind of kind of fucks up the setup sometimes. Three x. Wow, no three x there. Can I get multiple? Look at that. Stay. Oh, 
Oh, they're gonna miss though. Somehow connect. No, the 27x right there though. Give me another one. No, he deleted the 27 and gave us a 3x. We're in profit though, officially. But man, that, that was a situation right, right there. If that all started working together, would have been so much money, man. So much money. Nice, good connection. Right side, beautiful. Ooh, 27x with this. No, 27x to 36 would have been fire. Last spin. Ooh, this could be good. Three different hits. Connect these. No, it deleted them all. I hate that it's not consistent. That's the one thing that I really don't like about this game. Like, like it, it just randomly deletes some ultis sometimes for no reason. There's literally no reason. It's just, it's a chance to stay. 2.9K though, we'll take it. Now this one could be absolutely horrible. Zombie Carnival is another slot that I've had some really good hits on, but my God is this slot volatile. It's so volatile and it's, it chastises you too. When you, when you lose on this game, there's this fucking little, little zombie guy at the end of it. It's a little clown that goes, <laughs> you'll hear it at the end of it. Okay. I'm sorry if that was really loud, by the way, but you're going to hear it. So the concept of this game is you need, you need brain. You need dome, dude. You need as many brains to come down on the board as possible. When you get, uh, when you get a brain, the closest bear goes to it. It gives you a plus one spin and it makes the multiplier go up. If you get three brains at once, you get a retrigger. Like you'll get another bear and uh that's when it can really go crazy when you get another bear i actually had four bears down at once one time and it fucking went insane that was super good hit super good hit this one's not looking so good but see right there what i was gonna say is the good thing about this game is even if you have one spin left it could theoretically go for 10 more spins because all you need is one brain and then it retriggers no premiums were lined up there nice good retrigger good retrigger this guy's going to go over, which guarantees a hit because we have left to right. It doesn't have to be in a line with good multis here too. give me premiums. Nice premiums with the retrigger. That's a great hit. How much is it? 909. We'll take it. Beautiful. It's going to be harder to get a hit here, though. We need this symbol and this symbol to match premiums. No, not a bad hit, though. 1869 up next is a uh, it's a it's a hidden gem. It's a hidden gem. It's something that I've had a really good hit on as well. I just don't really ever play it. And I don't I can't remember if I've had any uploads of this game to this channel because I, I used to play it on stream called Book of Gold Sands. It's a fun one, but it's a really volatile one, too. And I uh, I've had some good hits on it, man. I've had some good hits on it. Let's try a twenty four hundred here. I love the whistle, too. We're listening to the whole thing, by the way. We're bonding over this whistle. It's like Mongolian throat singing. You can't pass it up when you hear it, dude. Look at that scatter animation, too. My goodness. Pragmatic. You guys know what you're doing. Wow, that's a really good symbol. I think perhaps that, yeah, third highest. Okay. So what we need here is we need to hit that symbol as many times as possible. Look at that. Good start. So now what this is going to do is it's going to put her in all three of these reels. And now every time we hit those reels from here on out, it's going to double the ways. So theoretically, if we got that same exact hit again, it would double the payout. So we just need that to hit as much as possible. <sighs> Two of them doesn't expand. That's brutal. Ooh, nice, nice, nice. That's going to be a good hit. And it builds this up even more. Very good. 648 there. This is this is starting off awesome. I love this premium symbol actually hitting. I love it. Retrigger would be insane with the symbol. Oh, come on. No, that would have been so good. Come on. Give us a hit. I sound like a fucking tweaker, dude. Y'all got any more of those premiums? Nice. That's going to be good. That's a double up right there. Beautiful. 1152 on that hit. Now give me a full screen. Come on. <gasps> no, it beats it. It beats it on the doubles. Wow. It basically broke even though. I'm going to run it back, but I'm not going to. I'm not going to. This next one <sighs> torched me on the last video I put it in. I think I put it into a random slot video uh, last week, I believe. And uh, it completely annihilated me. We're going to do a $3,000 buy here. Wild Bison Charge. Show me what you got. Show me what you got. 
So this is kind of like doghouse. We just need wilds to land with uh, good multipliers. Hey, three X opener. God, why, why does this slot spin this fast? Why does it have to spin that fast? We need more of these guys. Running out of spins though, it's not looking good. $3,000 buy on this too. Yeah, this is over. It's over. Ay, 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 this is ass. Dude, what? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm never coming back here again. Fuck this slot. Treasure Wild is last but not least. This is another slot I've had some really good hits on, but it's, it's a weird one and it's a volatile one and it gives you the choice of being degenerate, which is never good for my balance. So let me explain how this works a little bit here. Choose a number of starting coins for free spins. The more coins you get, theoretically, the better it's going to be because it means your chest is going to be higher. And what happens in this game is the coins go into the chest at the side and then every chest you get pays out the total coin value. So the more coins you get, the better it is. Um, usually when you buy mystery, it's pretty fair, but sometimes you just get fucked on it. But that being said, even with all the even buying more coins, you can still get bad values on the coins. So I usually like to just buy in at the mid range or sometimes just even go for the mystery. I think we got to go for the mystery here. $3,000 buy. So we want over nine coins. That's you know what? We'll take it. Not the best values, but we'll take it. We'll take it. Pretty, pretty mid range. Ooh, look at that. Two coins off the bat, though. Now this is a good chest. $340 every time a chest lands. Which a lot of times they land in pairs, too. There's another coin. 10. Come on. There's, okay, 350. 350, there it is. I don't know about a pay page on that, buddy. Paid 3,000 for this. Oh, no. Three spins left. Give me three chests now. Uh-oh. There's also a red coin, which red coin is always big. Last spin. Oh, no. 360 on a 3K buy. I got to run it back. Let's go for a 15 coin. Fuck it. Give me a million dollars out of this. That's pretty good. We got a 150 at the end. How much is it? 540. I mean, it's a $4,000 buy. So we only need eight chests to break even here. That's actually a lot, saying it out loud. Okay, $80, though. That's good. Come on. Chests, please. We have such a good value over there. Oh, this is going to hurt. It's going to no chest us. Oh, my God. $780 in here. No. Dude, is it about to no chest us? Three spins left. It's about to no chest us. Yep. $920. Wow. Uh, yeah, do not play this game. For it is dog shit. Oh, and then we get three chests on a base spin. Three chests on a base spin immediately after. Again, back to back three chests on a base spin. Yeah, fuck this game. Oh, that's a good hit. Look at that. 720, 720. I'm gonna have to run it back now, right? No, they're trying to trap us. I know a way to break even. We're gonna all in on crazy time. 